We begin with breaking news. Authorities say a body has been found in West Little Rock. Firefighters say the woman's body was located in Rock Creek. That's just west of Shackleford. Fox 16's Shannon Miller. She's live at the scene now with more. What are you learning, Shannon? Right, just different names. Uh, Donna and Kevin, these details coming in, and we are just hearing them from the detectives here, Richard Higgleman, as we have just gotten to the scene here as well. And um, again, this unfolding here just within the last hour or so, we believe this to be the body of a woman who got caught up in the floodwaters recently. So tell me just uh, how police were first alerted to this. Right. Uh, on April 30th, we were alerted. Uh, the husband was uh, rescued out of the water. Uh, we began the searching then as best we could. Obviously, the floodwaters kind of hindered that. Um, the search continued. We had our helicopter in the air today searching for following the creek. Um, then these two uh, gentlemen volunteered their time and put in some kayaks and started wading and kayaking through the uh, the creek there. Okay, I'm going to just pause. Hey, Annie, make sure we pan here to the to the side here. We've got the body coming up uh, the pathway here right now. This is at Birchwood Park, so I didn't mean to interrupt you. We just want to be sensitive to this unfolding situation. Um, so again, we believe this was a woman who was living in her tent and she and her husband got caught up in this flood water. That is correct. That's what we believe at this time. Okay. Um, and again, uh, uh, we know this. She was taken upstream um, from where she was initially um, living with her husband. And today, there was actually some folks who clean up creek areas who happened to come across her body. Right? Yes, that's right. They were volunteering their time to search for any kind of clues to help us out, uh, look for the tent, or potentially her and they did discover her. Okay. Thank you so much for taking the time. We know this is a developing situation. Um, we will probably, uh, I guess, anticipate a positive ID to come next year as uh, she is probably taken to the coroner's office uh, from this point forward. Thank you so much for your time today. We'll have much more on this story for you coming up tonight at 9, but for now, we'll send it back to you. And I